Welcome back to my garden guys. I'm just going to show you what you need to do for the third statistics practical using chi-squared. So we're going to collect some data that you could use to do a chi-squared statistical test. Okay so what you're going to need is a maze like this which I've made out of a cereal box. So all you need to do is to cut the two long sections and stick them together to make an L shape and then you stick a T shape on the top. Um, from one of the short sections. It doesn't really matter how long they are. Um, in fact, one, this one could be a little bit shorter, but it doesn't really matter. The other thing that you need to make is a sort of a gate. Well, it's kind of like a stopper that you're going to use in task one just to block off that end part. Okay, so that's the maze that you're going to need to make before uh, the task. Right, then you're going to need to go outside and collect some wood lice. So hopefully you might know where you might find some wood lice. Damp, dark kinds of places, under flower pots, under rotting wood, places like that. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to collect some um, easily. You need some kind of pot to put them in. And I'm going to use a plastic spoon to kind of scoop them up. You'll probably need about 20. Okay, so let's go hunt for some wood lice. So under here I've got quite a few wood lice, so all I'm going to do is just kind of flick them in to the pot, trying to be reasonably gentle. They're pretty robust crustaceans, so you might need to do this a few times. They might roll up into a ball. And one thing to bear in mind actually is that they are not all the same species, 